Okay, so a lot of times on these uh, water leaks, you know, sometimes it's, it's rain driven. Uh, but the good thing here, I checked the hill maps and there's actually been several hill storms that hit this house. So if there's an issue going on, hopefully we can find some damage on this roof uh, and get the roof uh, paid for by the insurance company. Uh, unfortunately, rain driven uh, water leaks never get paid for by the insurance company. So uh, in this case, if there really is a big issue, uh, and from the photos I've seen, there's water coming in the house, but we're really gonna need something like with some hail damage. And like I said, the hail report shows there's hail. So uh, I'm gonna get out, get on the roof, take a look, see what we can find, and hopefully uh, this homeowner is gonna have a lucky day. We'll see. Okay, so yeah, uh, there was a hole in the roof. Um, it wasn't caused by anything from like, you know, hell or anything like that. What it was, was somebody, when they were installing the roof, they put a tow board, which basically is a two by four that they nailed to the roof. And when they were done, so they could climb up on the roof because it was super steep. And when they did that, um, they took the tow board off the roof. They didn't plug the, the hole up. So all this time, water's been going in this guy's house and that water spot's been getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And we're talking about a hole that's the size of like uh, an eraser head on a pencil. That little hole right there caused all that damage inside of his house. So we're gonna get it fixed, uh, get it patched back up, uh, get it sealed properly, and then we'll move down the road. But that's what we do sometimes.